Welcome to the Cincinnati Metropolitan Housing Authority's Vendor Cafe Training for Vendors. In this module, we will discuss the Vendor Cafe dashboard and general navigation. This is the Vendor Cafe dashboard, which you will see when you log in to your Vendor Cafe account. We will discuss today the left hand menu, the top menu, and the center menu, which can be drilled down. We will discuss these in more detail on the next slides. The first menu we will discuss is the left side menu. This menu is present during all your activities in Vendor Cafe. The top button is the dashboard button or home screen button, which will return you to the dashboard that we reviewed in the last slide. The next button is the vendor profile button. If you click the plus sign to the right of the vendor profile button, it will create a drop down with different options. You'll recognize these options as those that you completed in the vendor cafe registration. The next button is the create or upload invoice button. If you need to upload your invoice, please click here. The next three buttons are purchase orders, invoices, and work orders. These buttons will all be discussed further in other CMHA Vendor Cafe training videos. The Q&A button allows you to send a question directly to CMHA. We would prefer if you would direct your questions to procurement at cintimha.com. The help button is next. If you click the plus sign, it will reveal different options for Vendor Cafe help. The bottom button is sign out. Always be sure to sign out of your Vendor Cafe account when you are finished. Like the left side menu, the top menu bar is always available during your Vendor Cafe use. Starting from left to right, we will discuss the different options of the top menu. The far left side with the three lines collapses the left side menu. If you cannot find your left side menu, please click here. The envelope with the drop down gives you access to your messages. The world uh, with the notification gives you access to your announcements. Um, your name gives you similar options to the left side menu. This is also where you will change your password. The headphones with support, that is how you access Vendor Cafe support information. You can select your preferred language on the next button. And then the last one is to select your client. If you have more than one agency or business that you are using Vendor Cafe through, this is where you'll choose which profile you will use. This is the dashboard center menu. The top lists your notifications. Profile status shows what clients you are using Vendor Cafe through. Cincinnati Metropolitan Housing Authority should always be selected. If you unselect or unsubscribe from Cincinnati Metropolitan Housing Authority, you will not be able to use your Vendor Cafe account. If you select invoices, purchase orders, or work orders, you will receive an overview tab showing your invoices, purchase orders, or work orders. We will go through those overviews on the next few slides. Shown here is the overview of invoices that you can get to by clicking the invoices button on the dashboard center menu. Invoices not submitted are those invoices that the vendor has started and saved but not yet submitted to CMHA. Pending invoices are those invoices that the vendor has submitted but that CMHA has not yet approved yet. The payment register are invoices that have been paid or will soon be paid and rejected invoices are those invoices rejected by CMHA. We will further discuss invoices in the invoices section of the CMHA Vendor Cafe training for vendors. Shown here is the purchase order overview screen. You can reach this screen by clicking purchase orders on the dashboard center menu. Purchase orders have two categories, received and unreceived. Purchase orders must be in received status for an invoice to be placed against them. We will further discuss purchase orders in an additional video provided by CMHA. This shows the work orders overview, which can be reached by clicking work orders on the dashboard center menu. The red X's have been applied over the proposals function, which CMHA does not use. Please ignore these sections. The assigned work orders listing lists those work orders that have been directly assigned to the vendor. Today's due work orders list those work orders which are due to be completed today. You can click on the number 
to see the work orders in either assigned or today's due work orders. We will further discuss work orders in a subsequent CMHA training video. For Vendor Cafe assistance, please see the other CMHA provided videos. If additional assistance is required, please contact Vendor Cafe support at the contact information below.